Okay, so this is well, the video when I, where I'm going to show you how it works in all the ambulatory dolphin. Okay, so I just open it. Prompts me, okay, yes. So there I have I have a couple of games, you know. Uh, it tells you whether the game is from Nintendo Wii or Nintendo GameCube, you know, it's, you can see there the logo, the Mii channel, everything all of those games work they work with the Wii mode uh, so now what I do sometimes, depending on how many people how many people are, are playing sometimes I use the Xbox 360 controller, you know and it's, it has a receiver I have it. I have the receiver inside the PC. This is this is mm -hmm. the USB cable that comes out of the PC from the receiver. Okay, mm -hmm. so I just plug it in. And I just turn it on. Uh, and the other thing I use is this adapter, USB adapter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This thing here I can connect these two controllers here and yeah. you see so it works you see so now let's see uh, I'll show you the um, Super Smash the game opens emulation begins I can use whether this is player one because I when I play those kind of games I like to play I like to use a I like to use a classic controllers but I didn't want to buy the Nintendo Wii classic controller one yeah so let's turn down the volume I can play Works really well, so let's pick uh, some of them and let's use this one. Look, it works really well. Yeah, and let's say I want another player, just, just keep adding controllers, and that's it. Yeah. Pick a random location. Yeah, it works really well. And graphics, you know. I don't know. I think I'll have to take maybe with a picture it'll look a little better. And vibration works. Look, I hit, I hit the player, and it vibrates. You see, my bricks. Okay, I just click. I just hit this if you if I want to get out from the game really fast. And the game I showed Kaku was my current way. <laughs> I clicked the wrong. Hold on. Just open. It. Okay, let's use the PS2 controller. The yeah, Xbox 360, sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. 
So, uh, now let's say I want to plug a, a P. Um, uh, I can I can I can connect a remote. I just need the remote. Yeah, but no batteries. Uh, I think I have another video where I show how to connect Wemos and I'm not sure. And a, and, a, and a bar, wireless. We bar. Yeah. And uh, no batteries. That's a recurrency part. This is part two. So I'm going to show how to plug in the Wemote. Okay. First of all, we go to the remote section remote real remote and we click on pair pair up now we press one and two at the same time on the remote now it says installing device driver software we just keep hitting, hitting, and hitting. When when the wind mode is recognized, we we click on update. Now it says play one, and it vibrates. And says one minute wind mode plugin. Now we click on OK. Okay. Uh. Now let's say we're going to go we go to the main channel. Okay, so okay the window itself you first you need a Bluetooth Bluetooth adapter to connect the window. It's blinking blue because it's receiving data. And you need the Wii bar. We wireless bar. This bar only I turn it on. It froze red and infrared. Hold on. Yeah, so I turn on. Now I can move my wheel. The screen. Look. Some of the people that I have to play here. Yeah. That's me. <laughs> yeah, so it does work. Look. Yeah. Okay. Say so if you exit, but the Wemo. With the remote is still plugged in. You can either turn it off if you want to turn it off, or you can still open the dolphin emulator again and you can reconnect it by just clicking on update update and then OK. Now graphics this is the gra those are the graphic settings I use. Uh, 1080, 1920, and 1080 because of the screen size. Uh, I use the v vertical synchronization, uh, full screen. Now we go to, uh, I don't know how to translate that in English, and I don't know why the emulator is on Spain, in Spanish. Internal resolution three times native because uh, the internal I mean the internal resolution game is actually uh, better uh, than what the Wii can emulate can can do I mean the Wii itself cannot cannot fully play a game you know I don't I don't know if you get it I don't know if I explain myself but yeah native three eights the anti aliasing for ads is the same. Anisotropic, anisotropic filtering 16 ads and F 
E F B, and you can even play on 3D. But for Zelda, for uh, Skyward Sword, I click the anti aliasing I go on none, else it won't play. Only for this game, I don't know why. Let's see, Skyward Sword, Skyward. The way mode it's plugged in. First thing it has to to connect a nunchuck. I forgot that. So here the here the nunchuck. I forgot the nunchuck. And we we plug it in. We just plug it in. You see? Now asks it asked us to put the Wii mode to calibrate. Yeah, okay, it says okay. Now to point at the screen. Hold on. Right there, right there, there. You see the game board. The game board's really, really great. Map, well, I bought this this bar at I bought this bar at eBay there in Miami when I when I went to eBay and yeah I, I mean I didn't I didn't I went to the place you know okay so now the last thing well this is the web page where I used to download the games and it's called that's the link. I'll leave I'll leave the link on your on the message. Message. And but you gonna you gonna register, register make an account. I have my account here. To the the site is in Spanish. But you but you can either download their Wii games from other sources. We just go to Nintendo Wii. And we go down, and there's a says this this we go there. Now we go, now we you just click the let's say we want Paper Mario. We go on P and we look for Paper Mario, and that's it. But sometimes it's kind of difficult, you know. Power Rangers, okay, there are, there are many things I don't know, I'm sure. Uh, well, you just click a. Uh, yeah, let's say this game, I don't know this game, I've never heard of it before. It's loading, trying the, the things, how much it, it is, and you, you, just, you just gotta make an account and you can download those kings for free yeah but you can download them from other places if you want to put a CD into into the CD drive I mean uh, an original Nintendo Wii game uh, well it won't work I think because you need something I don't know because I, I've never done it you need something else I mean the computer itself won't read it so yeah and um, yeah so that, that that's that's how it is, you know. Yeah. And 
I don't know what else to show you. <laughs> well, I have this one. Yeah. Really good game. I loved it. I love it. I love it. The saga was really good. Uh, I'm playing this one. They say this is an old game. Um, yeah, I didn't ever play Devil May Cry, so I, I, I finally, I finally playing it. But this is an old game too. This is really old. Optum Raider, the last one, yeah. Battlefield 4. Yeah, I didn't pay for any of those. Of those. <laughs> That's the good thing about me, Toronto. I didn't pay anything. Fable. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, like everyone says on YouTube, thanks for watching. <laughs>